Hi, this is Ginger from My Sister Scrapper. Today I want to share a project with you that I created using the absolutely gorgeous Graphic 45 Winter Wonderland paper collection. For my project, I use the 12 by 12 papers as well as the chipboard elements. This paper is absolutely divine if you have not seen it. Oh, it's just stunning, 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 stunning. Look, great, gorgeous cut apart. It's just amazing. So here's the project that I created. And again, it's um, a folio style. And it's the same as the folio that I did all those recipe folios for, but I did this as a Christmas folio. So on the front cover, I used the um, element from the signature page here with the cute barn and the bird. And then I added a uh, chipboard element here and here. I went around all the edges with walnut stain, and I did it kind of heavy on some of the edges. This is I fussy cut from the paper collection. It's a cute little stamp. And then this is a border strip that I cut from the collection and added it to the bottom. And then I continued from this section and wrapped it around here. And then this is the back. I used the beautiful poinsettia paper for the back. And those are the two spines. So again, there's a magnetic closure and it opens exactly like this. This is just the gorgeous paper because again, I have my magnets here. You can't put a lot on here and you don't want to add any thick embellishments. So it opens like this and I added a border strip here on the inside and that was from the signature page as well. And on the first side, you open it up. I have a large pocket here, stacked pocket actually. I have some more uh, elements that I cut apart another stamp, another little chipboard piece, and then I have some little tags here. These are all from the paper collection. Cute little trees. Love the birds. These are 4 by 6 so you can get a full 4 by 6 on the back of these as well. Again, another stamp that I fussy cut out and I put on some foam tape. Then I have two large tags back here. Again, they're plain on the back. And I just added some design paper here. Used my corner chomper, angle punch, for the corners here and then added some little stamps that I possibly kept from the collection. So those large tags go in there. Oops, and I think I have another one in there somewhere. Let's see. Yes, I do. Ha! Ah, cute little squirrel hiding in the bottom there. <laughs> so those go back in there. And then these go in this side. So the way this album works, again, another border strip right here. These are the actual pages, and then they're pretty large. And then inside I have photo mats, but I don't have any paper on them yet, so I'm going to add my, uh, I think I'm going to use some of the 12 by 12 patterns and solvers to decorate those. But I wanted to go ahead and shoot the video. So over here, again, the beautiful paper, it's just, you just can look at it because it's gorgeous. <laughs> and then these are the little tabs. Uh, pullouts that come out of the pocket pages and again they're plain on the inside for your photos and again some more design paper here they're exactly the same love the bird paper and again just gorgeous I added um, a strip of the cute little holly border right here to these two and then these flip over and these are exactly the same and I added some more of the fussy cat stamps right here some more of that cute bird paper with the gold background and the pine cones and snowflakes and then you flip it over and again I made a little pocket out of this 3x4 card and these were some more little cutouts I love the little reindeer this is winter wonderland and the little bird this is happy holidays again I attached a border strip right there just to break up some of the red and add some of the green there and on the back inside cover I went ahead and used one of the 4x6 cut aparts and made a pocket um, the cute bird and then here's the rest and I added some black cardstock to the back of these for photo mats so she can put a 3 by 5 card on the uh, photo on the back of those love these just gorgeous and again another little border strip that says winter wonderland so those go back in there and then over here this side flips open and this is where the 4 by 6 sleeves are and again I went ahead and used the 3 by 4 ones and the 4 by 6 and there's two, three, four, five, and I just left them empty because I'm going to put photos in there, holiday photos. And then on the back inside here, I just left this plain. And then you have the large accordion pocket over here. Again, this is the title from the signature page. This is Winter Wonderland. I fussy cut this little three by four card out and um, added it to the center here with a border strip of the holly paper. And then there's a magnet closure here. Again, some more of the gorgeous paper here and here. Love the reindeer. It's adorable. And then again, 
It goes like this, and it goes like this. So that's my folio using the beautiful Graphic 45 Winter Wonderland 12x12 paper collection and the chipboard element. So there you go, everybody. Thanks for watching. Bye.